Hello, hello everyone. My name is Bessie and this is Budget of the Bus. If you're a subscriber, welcome back. Love having you here. And if you're not, I hope you are by the end of this video. Today, what I am doing is my savings challenges and we're going to be finishing one very exciting challenge today. I cannot wait because it's been years in the making. But before we get into that, let's count how much we are putting into our savings challenge. It's probably the most I've ever put on this channel. And again, that is because there is one very specific <laughs> challenge that I really wanna finish. And for those who know, you know. Thank you for following along on my journey. This is my bank bag. This money you're gonna see in my next video when I stuff my sinking funds in cash envelopes. I just do it separately. And let's go ahead and count. So in our saving challenges today, we are going to put in 100, 200, 250, 270, 290, 310, 330, 350, 370, 390, 400, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95. Anywho, the, we are never, not I'm not gonna say never, but it is most likely we're not gonna stuff that high in my savings challenges because there are other sinking funds that I do also wanna bulk up, but this is what we're stuffing intentionally. So 4.95, but we do have to unstuff my cash envelopes, which comes in this little itty bitty binder. So we have $2 left over, gas is empty, spending has $10 left over, giving has, one, two, three, and personal keeps rolling over, and Web Slingers is my son's envelope, and that also keeps rolling over. If you wanna see me stuff my cash envelopes, go. don't forget to subscribe because it will be in the next video. So on top of the 495, we have an extra 10, but that goes into a specific rollover challenge. So 495, 505, 506, 507, 508, okay. 508, 509, 510. So technically we are stuffing $510. But out of these, two of them are gonna go into a sinking fund that I am trying to build back up for date night, which will you'll see in my next video. And these three will go in here. Let's get our binder. Here is our first binder, uh, and we do need a marker. I received this from Brittany at Plan Your One Life. I did win one of her giveaways, so I got this really cute pen, or pouch for my pens. I'll keep that out, and I think, definitely need my green, and maybe I'll use this orange too. So this, not this, these first challenges are my rollover challenge, um, yeah, my rollover challenge. Oh my God, how, why did I get stuck with that? So I have $3 here. So this three is gonna go in here and it is getting real thick. And then I color the little piggies in. So one, and I can tell by the, my tracker that I have $44 saved. Once I reach a hundred, this will all go towards paying just an extra payment towards a credit card. My $5, I didn't have any $5 roll over this time. That happens. So we're gonna skip that one. This one is for my $10. When I, I try and save one five and one 10 if I can. So this 10 will go in here. And I'm gonna mark this little flower off. So that means there's 10. So I probably, I did, not probably, I did reach $100 in here. But at the end of this, I am going to use it also to pay off debt. Now comes the piece of resistance, our, our big, biggie, biggie of the biggest challenges. Let's get into this one. And I cleared off everything because I wanna go ahead and let you guys know that I'm stuffing $220 into this challenge today. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna take the 220, which is these two, or and 220, I'm gonna put these to the side just real quick, actually, I'm gonna put these to the side right there. And let's get in, I need my marker, I need my marker. Okay, so now that I have my marker, I'm gonna put it right here. And we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight more envelopes. Let's go ahead and do the math real quick. So 220 minus 40, minus 38, minus 34, minus 33, minus 27, 
minus 23 minus 16 minus 6. I have three dollars left over which I again it's fine I didn't want to have singles really in in here floating around let's color these off and I'm not gonna even fast forward through this because you guys I'm gonna tell you right now this is years in the making so if you are doing the hundred envelope challenge and you are watching my video for the first time today just know that this is not how much I usually put in I think I've only ever put in like a hundred at the most and it was I was doing big envelopes first so like when I had hundreds I was literally just doing the 90s when I could and sometimes I didn't have enough money for it so I would do a 22 envelope I the first when I first started I was doing random envelopes in actual envelopes and then I decided the color the last one last one last six being colored in y'all we did it we did it <laughs> I mean, I did it, but we did it because so many of you guys have been doing this and it's really pushed me to be like, yeah, let's just complete it. Let's just get it done. I've seen the payoff and I am so excited. I'm really proud that I was able to finish this challenge because it was what I started before I even started my budgeting journey, before I even started my budgeting channel. But let's get into it. Let's get into it. Let's count. Let's count. Okay. So we have 4,500 city and high yield savings already. 100. So 4,600, 4,700, 4,800, 4,900, 5,000, 20, 40, 60. So 4,060 here. So I'm going to have well over 500, 100, $5,100. Yes. I am done with this challenge. I am done. I'm done. Oh my God. I am so done. I might do this again. <laughs> if my income ever drastically changes, I will start doing it again. But there are just so many other challenges that I really want to do. And I bet I could use a bunch of small ones and make them add up. So yes, I'm very excited. Look at that, just one more, just one more. I just wanna appreciate all the green, all the green in this now. I'm just so excited that this is done, honestly. Oh my goodness, okay. Let's get into the next challenges real quick. So Christmas is gonna get 10, but it has a tracker. And I'm gonna go ahead and mark off this little one right here. So this is gonna get $10. And currently in Christmas, we have 20, 30, 40, so $40. And now that we've finished our 100 envelope challenge, I can start throwing just a little bit more money at this one. Like instead of doing 10, I can start doing 20 so I can complete it faster and do more of them. This one, the little owl challenge, is gonna receive 10 as well. That's the little tracker for it. Did I do two fives or a 10? A 10, let me get the heart. So we're gonna go ahead and do this one real quick. I'm super excited. Like I said, then I can throw, instead of doing 10, I can do 15 on this one, you know, finish this one up a little bit faster because there's higher denominations for this challenge. Okay. our camping challenge so now we're gonna get into our coloring in part um, our coloring in portion and I do have some happy meal and I do want to shout out a channel and here we have what is my color in challenges which is really from um, another channel here on YouTube which is uh, from Lisa grateful me they have a shop on Etsy and all of these challenges are linked in my description check out her channel and also check out our shop so this one is gonna get 10 but let me, oh my God, I like don't memorize it. I literally just looked at it. So my Easter savings was gonna get, my camping savings was gonna get $10, okay. Put that in here. Let's pick a color. I hope you guys can see that. I mean, I can see it here, but Hopefully you guys can see it up there. And we have 20, 30, 40 saved up because we do like to go camping around summer. We did last year and I just wanna be better prepared with a specific saving challenge for it. Valentine's we completed in our last saving challenge video, so I'm not gonna to touch that one right now. Our Easter is also getting, I think it's getting, it's just there and I literally looked at it. It's getting 15 this time. because Easter is coming up. 
put that right there. So let's color off 15 real quick. So now we've colored off three icons for $5, so that gives us 15. And in total we have, oh, let's organize this cash. 20, 40, 50, 55, 60. And this is all gonna go towards like my son's Easter basket. We already have the eggs from like two years ago. We just keep recycling them when we can. I probably buy like one new pack at the Dollar Tree. The next one is a new challenge, which is from Cute Budget. She just sent me this and I think it's so, so cute. And each of these icons, it's a birthday fund, which is perfect because my son's birthday is at the end of April. So I need to throw an extra savings challenge at it. So we're gonna go ahead and give all of these like a specific number, I'm gonna use black. So these little icons right here, I'm gonna do a big 50. The cakes, I'm gonna do a 20. These little presents, I'm gonna do 10. And these little ones, I'm gonna do a five. I'm not gonna stuff anything for this challenge this week because I just got it today and I did not have time to like rearrange how much and because I was putting so much into my other one. But now that I finished my other one, I can do more challenges and I'm gonna put the envelope here because I also have one more challenge from Lisa Grateful Me. It's her birthday challenge. I completed it last year and it was super helpful because it's for $200. But in here, I'm gonna go ahead and put 30 and where let's go color these off. Now we have 30 saved up for his birthday and we're gonna go ahead and combine those two challenges. So this one and this one and that should give us a really good amount for his birthday. Our next saving challenge goes here, but I also have some happy mail that I need to show you guys because not only did I get that challenge, but I also received this from, I'm gonna show you guys real quick because I already opened it and could not help myself from the, um, the Almost Organized Owl. Like I was reading it, I don't know why I was reading this silently first, but the Almost Organized Owl, she gave me a little thank you card and I know Erica from Black and Blue looks of it when we read it, so we must read it. Hi, Bessie, thank you for your support. I hope you enjoy the challenges, have fun savings. I will, and I got a $100 place holder and this is just like an extra little savings oh my god I love this because I'm gonna use this for myself this is gonna be my own so I'm gonna put this here and I got this from her seven weeks of savings and like I said I just finished that last challenge and that was like about 150 I was using for the past couple of months to really like tackle it to fill it to really finish it and again that challenge don't worry if you don't finish it within a year or even two years like it took me at least three and a half years you guys I think okay but it comes like this and the instructions are scratch and complete the challenge under the scratch off then save so each one of these is a scratch off and then I'm gonna save it. So let's do one together because I wanna start this next time. I keep saying so, I keep saying so. And my little scratch off pendant is here. Yes, it is. Okay, and we're gonna combine two. Oh, you know what I'm gonna do? And this is what I do a lot and you'll see it on my channel. I combine challenges. This one next time, scratch. And here is what it is. It is, so you complete the challenge, which is call a loved one that you haven't spoken to in 30 days, and then I say $15. So by next time you see me recording, I will have done that. And I absolutely love, I love this. I received them from Shai, who's in sunny Puerto Rico and is setting up her beautiful home. I can't wait to see her. She showed us her setup recently. Check out her channel, it'll be linked in my description and it's cash and spanglish and she sent us all these valentine's day gifts but eight dollars i scratched off last time so i'm going to stuff 10 i stuffed 10 today i'm going to go ahead and scratch off the next number which is three and i'm just going to round that up to five next time i do this a lot i always just kind of round up let me know if you also round up any challenges or your savings or something so I'm gonna combine Shy's challenge, I'm gonna combine this one from the Almost Organized Owl in here. And that is where that will go. This one is this challenge right here, which I won. Their channel name was Planning With Boys. I think it's Allie right now. Uh, so yeah, check out their channel, I won it. I scratched off 10. 
but let's, before I count, I'm gonna scratch off what I need to do next time. I like to scratch off ahead. I know people scratch off in the moment and then take from whatever they have, but I need to know the correct denominations. So let's start here. All right, so we're gonna stuff five next time, but you know what, let's do one more. Let's do one more. I always do this, I always do one more. I feel like that's a one. That's totally a one. So six dollars, I can do one more. I can do one more. Fifteen. So we're definitely <laughs> we're definitely gonna stop here. That this is what I get for sorry for the table shaking, everyone. I just want to get all this scratch off dust off the table. So next time I'll be stuffing five twenty twenty one. Twenty one dollars. And so far in here, I'm gonna start. This is like the jump off for my saving challenges for summer because around May, I start really picking up the saving challenges for vacation in July. So far in here, we have 10, 20, 30, 35. Okay. And this next portion of my video is basically scratch off challenges. And the next one is from Cosplay Girl Budgets. It is this scratch off, the Garden of the Justice one. It saves a hundred dollars. I'm supposed to put in 20. And let's see what we're gonna do next time. 20, no, 10, 10. So $10 next time. And we have a total of 20, 35 in here so far. We have, I think, only like two more scratch off uh, challenges, guys. At the end of this, I'm gonna have a little pile of all of the scratch off dust, but I cannot help it. I cannot help it. This one is color scratch and save. It's gonna be for $200. And again, linked in my description from Currency Queen Budgets. Uh, let's go ahead. For this one, I was gonna do 25. Let's see how much we're gonna do next time. And it looks like we're gonna go ahead and scratch off, or not scratch off, put 15 in here. Okay, this one now has a total of 25. Probably gonna use this one for vacation too, because I probably won't be done with it until May. And this one is my monthly scratch off challenge. Let's see, I am finishing up a total of 55 in here today. And we have a total of 50, 70, 90, 95, 100, which is right here at the corner. That's how much I was supposed to save. And we're gonna go ahead and start off with March now. So I'm gonna go all the way to the back to grab March. And let's see how much we're gonna put in next time. Let me clear up more of this. All right, let's start with this bottom one. And in this one, I scratched off a whopping $70. Yes, yeah, 70. So this one, I'm gonna stop there. I'm, I'm gonna stop there. I'm not gonna go too crazy on this one. And that is it for my scratching, my scratch off challenges. So we're gonna get into this one, which is my 2023 in 2023. And I am stuffing. So in this one, I'm gonna go ahead and do 20. Yeah, let's see. I gotta find a 20. Oh, right here at the very bottom. So 20. And now I have a total of 100, 120, 140. So this one is coming along, oh, you know, pretty nicely. Here we have our Disney vacation. It only usually gets 10. I want to start pumping, you know, putting more in here. And I'm taking out the tracker because once now I add the 10, I have 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 200, which means we need four castles colored off. And, because each castle is worth $50. And that is it. Okay. Definitely need to start adding more in there if I wanna take a vacation next year to Disney World. This one is going to receive 40. 
because I want to finish this off before we go to Disneyland and we're also going to go to Universal Studios. So I want to have extra cash for souvenirs, food, all of that good stuff. So that goes there. And let's go ahead and color off her little bow right here. Okay. And count, we have 150, 70, 90, 95, 96, 97. So $197. That is it for these challenges. And I have just two more things to show you. I also received some happy mail from Baking Budget. She is a new channel on here and she also just opened up an Etsy shop. So thank you. Hers also came with the thank you note. Bessie, thank you so much for your order. Happy Valentine's. Happy Valentine's. I hope you enjoy these items as much as I do. And I know I am because I didn't know it was going to be the first. I knew she said that like the first five people get this little gift. And I didn't think I was going to be the first five people. Check out her channel. Check out, like everything is just so cute. It's just like, oh my God, I'm loving the vibe over there. But look at this little cute frog. Oh, he's gonna be hanging out during videos now. And I did order a challenge. I don't know what I said I was gonna use it for. <laughs> I really like in the moment was like, yes, I'm gonna use that challenge for this. But let's see. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. So I ordered, which one did I order? I think I ordered, <laughs> I ordered this one. It is a savings challenge and I think it's for $600, I want to say, maybe less, maybe 300. I can't remember. It doesn't matter. I, I kind of like to be a little surprised and this is, I love these. Look at these. And this is another savings tracker. Um, I don't know what I'm going to use this one for, but I am going to find a use for it. And a $500 placeholder for Bluey. Bluey's so cute. My son does really love watching Bluey. We love watching Bluey. She and her sister are so cute. And yes, Bluey's a girl, if you didn't know. Um, it's I didn't know for a long time. Oh, I'm going to put those right there for right now. And so check out her channel and check out her shop. Um, I have one more challenge because speaking of my son, it's a challenge for him. It's his little box. This is how I always finish off my videos. I'm going to put in the 10 right here. And I want to thank everyone so much. New subscribers. I know there's a lot of you. I haven't really done a really great reintroduction of myself. My name is Bessie. I'm a mom. I'm a wife. I'm a Virgo. <laughs> I work in uh, the public not in the public, but it's in the public, but at a public school, I'm a community school director. So my job really entails creating a vision for the school and supporting the school and creating more um, access for supports for students um, in our communities. So that is exactly what I do, like after school programs, before school programs, lunch clubs, all of that good stuff. But yes, thank you all so much. I appreciate you being here with me. Oh my God, these are, I still can't get over how cute these are. Look how cute those are. Um, but yes, thank you all so much. Have a good one. If you haven't subscribed, don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to hit that like button. Don't forget to leave, to leave a comment. Even this emoji means so much to me and I'll check you out in my next video. Bye.